What's up? This is 28 Godzilla here again, and I'm coming back with my first video in a long time since I'm back on YouTube. Um, I know this is going to sound bad, but uh, this is a rant video, so uh, let's get started. So what I want to talk about is the problem with Walmart and its overstocking with a certain item. And that is the Jurassic World line. They just put too much of the one item that nobody buys anymore on the shelves. We never get anything new, which is a problem. We don't get any new dinosaur toys in the collection. So, it's just a really big shame. And I don't really think it's fair. We have... Now, I'm calling you guys out because this is absolute bullshit, but I'm calling you guys out in Franklin, New Jersey's Walmart. You guys have way too many Roar of Ors figures. You guys have like a mountain of them, and nobody is buying those anymore. That is wave one shit. You can find that on eBay for like $5 a toy. Honestly. Do something about this. This is a problem. Like, this has become such a big problem that Walmart employees can't even figure this out. You have too much of the one item that is in stock, and you notice that there is a very little amount being sold. So, what do you do? You decide to get more? No! Why? I don't understand this, honestly. That's what I think Walmart does. I even asked an employee if they were getting anything new regarding the primal attack line or just anything new in general that Walmart has never seen before. And they told me, oh, we're not getting it until March or April. Are you kidding me? That's like another four months. Three to four months. But that's, this is just insane. You can't do this, Walmart. You need to get rid of this stuff and get new stuff. I just don't understand what Walmart is doing anymore. This is a problem. And it's it doesn't just stop at the Roar of Wars part. There's battle damage and Savage Strike toys that haven't been sold either. Yeah, there's a large amount of those in every store as well. Neither of those lines really get sold and uh this is a real problem as well so um what do you think we should do about this guys do you think we should uh tell mattel that uh walmart is not doing their job and getting new stuff in and here's the thing when walmart does get something new in for jurassic world they only get one they get one toy that is new. What is the rest of us supposed to do? Are we all supposed to fight over the toy? Because that's going to be a problem. If you only buy one, there's going to be a problem if you only buy one new toy and expect everybody else to try and get it before everybody else can. That's pretty stupid, honestly. But back to what I was saying before. We need to fix this somehow. Um, even, even a child could figure this out. You take the old toys, the ones that aren't being sold, and you have an overstock on, and you move them to clearance. You mark them down, you set a clearance price, and then people will go and buy them, probably. And if they don't sell, you get rid of them, or you send them back to Mattel. It just, it's not that hard, Walmart. It's not freaking rocket science. Ugh. Seriously, these guys are freaking Einsteins. <laughs> uh, but whatever. I'm done. I'm, I'm going to try and figure out what to do now. So, let me know if you guys agree with me and uh, if we should fix this problem. Because this is just out of out of hand. It's ridiculous now. So, comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.